corresponding is here again. It's uh, some students, yes, Usama and Silva are coming, will come. Okay, guys, so uh, we finished, we finished unit five. And today, inshallah, we start uh, with unit six. It talks about life's ups and downs. What's the meaning of life's ups and downs? Who has any idea about it? Life's ups and downs. That's good and bad things. Life's ups and downs. Yes, life ups means the good things. Life downs means the bad things. This is this is just the title. So inshallah in unit in this unit we study grammar about past simple. Uh, regular and irregular verbs. Regular and irregular verbs. And we also study describing feelings. Happy, sad, angry. And also we talk about dates. So uh, let's start. Uh, I want to ask you about your grandparents. Do you know something about grandparents? Ah, grandparents, your your grandfather, your grandmother, they are your grandparents. Yes. So someone is writing. Ah, yes, Shams, uh, it is on page. Wait a minute. Yeah, guys, please, if you have the books, um, open page, page 46. Page 46 of your book. You like this? Okay. So here, we talk about uh, your grandparents, like grandfather and grandmother. Where were they born? And what were their jobs? Were they rich or poor? Yeah, when I ask you, where were you born? Uh, how can you answer? Ahmed, where were you born? In Syria. Yeah, say, I was born. I was born in Syria. In Syria, thanks. So this is the answer. I, like this. I was born in Syria. Yes, like this. So, Ahmed, uh, your grandparents, where were they born? Where were they born? Maybe they were born in Syria too. Ah, they were born in Syria too. Uh, were they rich or poor? Were they rich or poor? Not rich and not poor. Yeah, so half and half. Like this. Thanks, Dua. Uh, where were you born, Dua? Dua, are you hearing? Maybe she has a problem in her mic. Yes, Umar. Umar, you are hearing. Yes. So, Umar, where were you born, Umar? Where were you born? Ah, it's okay, it's okay, Dua. no problem. Umar, where were you born? Fahamch. Yani, aina wulet akala. Khalid, Khalid, be honest. No, yeah. but, but I ask you, Umar, I ask you, I was born in. Okay, so let, let me ask Silva. So Omar, please listen. Huh? 
Silva, when were you, when were you born? Uh, I born in Syria. I was I was born in born Syria. In Syria. Yeah. Um, thanks. Let me ask Sumaya. Sumaya, where were you born? I I was born in Yemen. I was born in Yemen. Great. Like this. I'm sorry, teacher. Yeah, yeah, but uh, Omar, please mute yourself. Omar? I was in Yemen. No, it's me. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, but I talk, I, I talk to uh, Omar. Omar, uh, please mute yourself. Can you hear me? Teacher. Uh, 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 mute. Uh, yeah, like she said, I was born in Yemen. Thanks. Uh, Ibrahim, what about you? Where were you born? I was born in Saudi Arabia. Yeah, I was born in Saudi Arabia. Yes. What about uh, Sharifa? Where were you born? I was. I was born in Turkestan. Ah, I was, I was born in Turkestan. Great. Shams, what about you? I was born in Syria also. I was born in Syria too. Great. Uh, the last one, Khaled. Tell us about you. Khaled, you are hearing? Ah, Khaled maybe doesn't hear or he has a problem in his mic. No problem. Okay, guys. So here, you all of your answers, I was, I was, I was born. So this is what? Past. Something happened in the past. You like this? So here, before we study uh, grammar about past symbol, let me show you the difference المضارع البسيط والماضي البسيط. So present symbol we use it for something we do it every day. Habits. يعني عادات أو حقائق علمية. Say uh, I go to school. I get up at five o'clock. I eat breakfast. I eat lunch. I eat dinner. So this is we do it every day. But past symbol something happened and finished in. In the past, and hadith, hadith wintaha fil maadi. So, uh, we have this woman. Do you know? Do you know her? What's her name? Opera. Opera. What's her name? Opera Winfrey. Opera Winfrey. Like this. So, Ahmed, where is she from? Yes, Ahmed, you are hearing? Yes, guys? Dura, uh, okay, uh, let me ask uh, Silva. Are you hearing Silva? Uh, yes, yes. Yeah. Ah, Ahmed, Ahmed, he, he came now. So, uh, so, Ahmed, what does Obera do? She is what? Is she a doctor? TV she... star. Oh, a TV star. And she is also a millionaire. And she is also what? A millionaire. Yes. So this is her photo. Like this. So we want to talk about her, about the woman. Yes. So I want you to listen and complete here. Write the verbs. You understand? Yeah, here is, we need to complete the verb. One, two, three, four, five, uh, six verbs. You like this? So let me just, uh, are you ready? Yes, yes. Please, yeah. You write the answer on your notebook, please. So open your notebooks, please, to write the verbs. One, uh -huh, two, Three, four, five, five. 
Yeah, open your notebooks to write the answer. I will prepare the listening now. I'm preparing it. Yes. We need Bluetooth. So we need this. Ah, yes. So let's just start. So let me close it. Here, yeah, this one. Yes. Unit 6, tape script 6.1, Oprah. Yeah, Oprah, listen. Huh? Listen here and complete. TV star and billionaire. A, the woman. Oprah went. Wait a minute. Just to make a little. Free is a famous American TV star. She lives in California, but she also has an apartment in Chicago where she works. Oprah is one of the richest women in America. She earns millions of dollars every year. She gives a lot of money to charity. Again, again, maybe some of you didn't finish. Six. Tape script 6.1. Oprah, TV star and billionaire. So she, she is a billionaire, not millionaire. Billion. Billionaire. Yeah. The woman. Oprah Winfrey is a famous American TV star. Ah, so is a famous American TV star. Look, all of the verbs here in present simple. Because they talk about habit, routine, like this. So the second one, uh, Ahmed will give me the first answer, okay? Number two, Ahmed, listen. She lives in California, Live. but she, she lives. lives. She lives in California. Let me write it in red to be easy for you. Sorry, she lives in California. Good. Uh, Dora, you are hearing Dora? Ah, uh, Omar. Omar, tell me about number three. She also has an apartment in Chicago where she works. Omar, she also. Again, please. Apartment in Chicago, where she went. But she also has an apartment in Chicago, where she also. Chicago. Uh, again. Has. Oh. She also has an apartment in Chicago. Great. Has. Has. She also has, she also has an apartment in Chicago. Yes. Silva, the next one. She works. Oprah is one of the where she works apartment in Chicago where she works. Where she? Yes, Silva. Where she? She does not think right. Again, again, huh? She has an apartment in Chicago where she go where she works. Where she works. Works. Great. Where she works. Where she works. Yeah, the next one, I talk to uh, Sumaya. Huh? Oprah is one of the richest women in America. She earns millions of dollars every year. She? She what? Uh, again, again, Sumaya. Millions of dollars every year. Again? in America. She earns millions of dollars every year. You, you got it? Um, no, million of dollars. Ah, uh, she earns. Listen again, Sumaya. Earns, huh? Yeah, she earns. 
Okay. In America, she earns millions of dollars every year. She earns. I work, I earn money. Yes. Uh, thanks, Maya. Let's go to Ibrahim. Uh -huh. She? She gives a lot of money to charity. Gives. She gives. Eight. Thanks, Anna. So, next one, she. Sorry about this. Next one, she gives. Yes. Okay, guys. So, thanks all of the verbs here. So, the verb number, number one is. She gives three. She what? Has. Has. Four. She works. Works. Five. She yeah. earns. And finally, she gives. gives. So all of these verbs, all of these verbs are in present symbol. Because they talk about routine. Uh, thanks for doing this exercise. Let me ask you these questions. I have some questions here. Uh, the first one will be for Sharifa. Sharifa, where and when, sorry, is opera? Is Obra rich? Is Obra Winfrey rich? Yes. Ah, uh, yes, because she is she is a, a billionaire. She billionaire. is a billionaire. Thanks, uh, Shams. Where does she live and work? Where does she live and work? She lives in uh, California. Oh, she lives in California. But she also has an apartment in here. In America. In Chicago. Yeah, Chicago in America. Thanks. Um, let me ask uh, Khaled. Khaled, how much does she earn? How much money does she earn? Every year. Yes, Khaled, are you hearing? Uh, I doesn't hear, maybe. Let me ask... Uh, let me ask... Uh, Silva. Uh, Silva, how much does she earn? Uh, she earns millions of dollars every year. Great, thanks. She earns millions of dollars every year. Thanks. So, all of these verbs are in present symbol. Now, let's talk about her childhood. Do you know something of childhood? When she was a child. Guys, I give you, I give you uh, three minutes to read this and underline the, the verb in the past. Ah. Opera was born. Uh, her parents were. Uh, yes, three minutes. Three minutes.
Okay, that's it. Okay, let me ask uh, some of you. Yes, uh, Khalid, are you hearing? I was that. So Khalid, uh, give me another word. Head bench were poor. Uh huh. Worked. Worked. They were. Uh, she worked in a coal mine. Lived. You know the meaning of coal mine? Yani man jam faham. Man jam faham. Coal mine. And also, she, uh, her mother, what? Cleaned. Cleaned. Yes, thanks, Khaled. Omar, give me another verb. Omar, they, what's the word that we've been talking about? They. Omar, you are here, right? Oh, Omar, maybe he isn't here. Let's talk to uh, Silva. Silva, what is the other verb? Ah, it's okay, it's okay, Dua, no problem. Silva? They? Uh, I can't hear. You are talking? Yes. Yes, Silva. So the next verb, what is it? Bar symbol. Uh, yes, this is another verb, Silva. They, they. Couldn't look. Oh, they couldn't late. They couldn't. And also, Silva, and also she. Lived. Lived also, bar symbol. Thanks. Uh, Sumaya, another, another verb in the past. Um, Oprah. I did. Was late. Uh, and she, she called, yes. Was great and studied. Was there. Uh, Studied, thank you. Studied also? Yes. So, Ibrahim, another to finish? Started. Oh, great. Started. Yes, like this. Thanks. So, this is about, this is about, uh, this is about Oprah when she was a child. When she was a child. Like this. So, uh, I want you just to listen, listen to this. Yes. Yeah, just listen. Oh, um, yeah, this one. Yes. So one minute. Speaker. B. Her childhood. Yes. Oprah was born on January 29, 1954, in Kosciuszko, Mississippi. Her parents were very poor. Her father, Vernon, worked in a coal mine, and her mother, Vernita, cleaned houses. They couldn't look after Oprah, so she lived with her grandmother, Hattie May. Oprah was clever. She could read before she was three. When she was 17, she received a scholarship to Tennessee State University, where she studied drama. She also started reading the news at the local radio station. Oh, thanks. So, uh, her family in the past was poor or rich? Poor. Her family poor. Poor. poor or rich? Poor. 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 Her family was poor in the past. Yes, she also, she has got a scholarship. What does it mean, scholarship? Scholarship, scholarship here. She received scholarship to study at the university. Minha? Minha, scholarship. 
So she received a scholarship to study at the university. She studied what? Business? Did she study business? No. No, she studied what? Drama. Drama. She studied drama. Great. And was she clever? Was she smart when she was a baby or a child? Was she smart? Look here, yes. this. Yes, because here they said she could read before she was three. And cannot. This عمرها ما وصل ثلاث سنوات وبلشت تقرأ. So she was smart. She was what? Smart. Like this. Okay. Thanks for doing all of these exercises. Uh, we still have just uh, three to four minutes. I will give you an idea about uh, grammar and inshallah, tomorrow we finish. Yes. So, just quickly. Past symbol. Zaman and Madal Basit. Like this. We use it for something. Something. Sorry. Something. Happened. And finished in the past. Then Haja Hasarat went ahead to Madal. She cleaned. She studied, she, she finished, she played, she went. طيب كيف نشكل هذا الزمن في حالة بوزيتيف؟ بوزيتيف. In the positive, yeah. So we use subject plus verb. الفعل. هنا في حالتين. إما الفعل نضيف له إيدي. إذا كان منتظم regular إذا كان الفعل الشاذ يكون بالتصريف الثاني verb to irregular بنعرف أمثل عليه like this so this is in the positive yes so for example subject he, she, it, I, you, we, they yes for example he uh, the verb or she, huh? she. The verb clean. Clean. Regular or irregular? And fa'al. Clean. Muntadam or la'sha? Regular. Regular. Ayy fa'al. To be for the ED, fa'al muntadam. She, clean. You add ED, clean. The house, yesterday. Come on, min alamato. Min alamat had the zaman. Uh, huh, yesterday, last, last week, last night, last day, last hour, any last. Uh, ago, mundo, 10 years ago, 5 years ago, and also, and also, date in the past. 90 in 2009, 2010. 1999 irregular فعل شاذ طبعا راح ارسل لكم بقائمه الافعال الشاذه مع ترجمتها للعربي عشان يسهل عليكم القائمه راح ارسلها لكم ان شاء الله في قائمه ما تنسى تفسير القاعده نفسها اللي كتبتها والقاعده كمان راح بس القاعده لازم نكمل لازم ارسلها كامله سو تو ما وي فينيش اند اي سند ات تو يو Okay. okay, tomorrow I will send you okay. regular verbs and send you the rule. Like this. Because mm -hmm. time is up. Now, this is the first thing that I have to say. I have to say that 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 I
irregular verbs اللي هو الأفعال الشاذة. For example, go where is go. مرتبين أبجديا. Go went. تصريف الثالث gone. Speak. Ah. Speak. Spoke. Sleep. Slept. Slept. Yes, Omar. This is the first one. Ah, the one that I took from before. 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 Yes, like this. So. Uh, in the past symbol, we use subject. We, we add ed if the verb regular. clean, uh, play, listen, listen, clean, cleaned, play, played, cock, cocked. Like in the past, we have to go, went. Yes. Uh, I saw, I saw. My teacher in the supermarket last weekend. Look, so, see, so. This is irregular. Next. Okay, we we'll stop here. So, inshallah, tomorrow we finish this and I give you uh, some grammar about uh, irregular verbs. Um, before we finish, before we finish, طبعا هاي الصفحة لسه متبقية من الوحدة السابقة بكتاب الواجب فما ما راح تأخذ منكم وقت. So please, it is on page thirty four. Page thirty four. Workbook. أتمنى اليوم تكملوا هاي الصفحة فقط. In the workbook. Five minutes. Ten minutes, Mr. Kathir. So after you finish this, this is your homework for today. فقط هذا الواجب هو اليوم. We stop here. That's enough. Who has any question before we finish? Oh, guys, one minute to check the names. We have another one minute. Who has any question before we go? من عنده أو عندها أي سؤال 